And with the anchor man Gary Austin. Good morning, Gary. Well, good morning. This update is service of American Metal Roofs. Check out the website, AmericanMetalRoofs.com, and you'll never, ever have to worry again about the weather with a beautiful, guaranteed American Metal Roof atop your house. All right, across the state, while we were sleeping, those who have the job of changing the signs out front of those gasoline stations, they were busy. If you haven't noticed already, you will when you head to the office. A sizable price jump in what we've got to pay. Virtually everywhere in the state, the price is now over $4 a gallon. In some cases, close to four twenty now. By the way, the record was set in 2008 at four twenty one a gallon, and the experts say we are well on our way to shattering that one. Last year at this time, did you know we were paying right around $3 a gallon? So quite a jump in the last year or so. Governor Snyder, he's getting ready for a big talk on education. That's going to happen tomorrow, giving a sort of preview peek. He said yesterday schools have got to do more by way of technology and innovation. The governor contends more flexibility is needed for teachers and schools, and he's also saying he feels there are advantages to having teacher tenure and performance pay standards in place. Funeral today for Eric Zapata the Kalamazoo Department of Public Safety officer who was shot and killed by a man last week. The suspect later killed himself. Officer Zapata's funeral will start at 11 this morning on the campus of Western Michigan University inside Miller Auditorium, and thousands are expected to attend, and from all over the country, hundreds of police officers will be there, too. Along the funeral procession, streets will be lined with American flags. Florida Pastor Terry Jones is expected to be in court later today, appealing that ruling from last week that would not let him protest out front of a Dearborn mosque, citing safety concerns. Jones was jailed and was let out only when he posted bond. And he was told to stay away from that mosque for three years. Reports have indicated he may have a protest soon, another one, this time in front of a Dearborn City Hall. Jones getting a lot of attention when he threatened to burn a Koran in 9-11. With news, I'm Gary Austin. And I'm Michael Patrick Shields in the American Metal Roof Studio. Find them at AmericanMetalRoofs.com and save up to 50% on your energy bills with an energy audit. Back in a flash.